Hello there, this is our boy Jack and in this video I'll be showing you how you can actually block a anti-blocker. Okay, so uh, what happens that in most of the cases while the ad revenue is getting lower and lower, in that cases the website is used anti-ad blocker. Okay, anti-ad blocker now how is anti-ad blocker? It actually uh, checks if you have ad blocking plugin such as ad blocker plus, ad blocker etc 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 and an anti-ad block actually block that thing and now we're going to block that anti-ad blocker okay so without wasting any time let's get started with the video so open up your browser after that copy the link which is given in the description and after that just simply paste it and paste and go and um, the link is github slash streak slash internet block clear killer and that is actually a direct link okay and uh, then go all the way down to that instruction forget about the donation you don't want it and if you are if you like the word then you can actually donate them so at this step one we need a script manager there are um, several script managers such as grazer monkey temper monkey violent monkey ninja kid etc 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 and although temper monkey is popular and almost available for everything well not for actually in the Mozilla Firefox well select any one of them which you actually like okay so just if you want to use I mean if your browser is Mozilla Firefox then you have to go to if you click this link and if you're from uh, that Chrome then you have to click this link and if you're using Opera then if you're using Safari you can use if you're using internet uh, yeah, like Windows Explorer Edge um, so I'm basically using Chrome so I'm going to go in for the Chrome icon just simply click here oops it's not like this make sure that you right click and go ahead simply right click and open a new tab so now we need to install that temper monkey which um, will take it to this side and just simply click on add to chrome and in case of mozilla firefox it will be something similar just simply add the extension okay so looks like uh, take a look it's been downloading so um, okay let it be download so there you can see it's been added it's been added to the chrome and so we don't need this uh, sites anymore we simply clear them and now at the step two is filter list we have to subscribe then well if you like them work only then subscribe but um now for now i have not going to subscribe them anyways uh, now to install the user script well, basically you can actually um, install anyone from any on site you can install from Wix that you can install from aggressive for you can install from open user us and you can also install from github.com so if you can let github.com we don't want to switch it we're simply going to install it okay so once we click install it will take you to the extension and after getting into the extension simply click install and it's it will be installed okay so that's all that side but we don't have any kind of i mean ad blocker so how it will work if you don't have ad blocker okay so without ad blocker let's go ahead to some um, website uh, that is a popular service for progress i guess okay for it okay simply we're going to go to that side and it's going to be asking for a and uh, there you can see it shows a lot of ads which you don't actually want for that we're going to use a ad blocker let's install ad blocker plus yeah i like ad blocker plus that because it is uh, really comfortable with these things okay so we're going to install ad blocker plus so let's install it and program for chrome you have to get it from chrome if you're using mozilla Firefox, you can also get it okay <coughs> after going to the web store we're going to simply add to chrome and simply add extensions okay we have installed it successfully and if you just simply refresh it's going to show it okay here you are using the temperament so it will not show that turn off your uh, ad blocker please black and white listers and etc 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 but it will not show the script was already escape is active and here you can see they have already made two three okay four requests 
uh, which we are actually uh, bypassing. So for checking, okay, just making sure that it's working. So I'm gonna disable this by clicking it here and just simply refresh this thing and let's see if it's still working or not. Let's open a post. And there you go. It's asking me to turn off my ad blocker. Now, why ask for turn off the ad blocker? Because if they earn through the ads, and if you just simply block the ad, then how will they earn? So that's why they use the anti ad blocker, which we are probably not gonna use. And actually, most of the people hate ads, so we are simply going to enable the thing, enable the script, and as soon as we enable the script, we have to refresh this. And once it refresh, it's boom, it's working man.